Hey, you know what? Fuck it. <laughs> of course, ours rings. Hello? Grace, what are you doing? What am I doing? Yeah. I'm about to catch a bus. Why? I need to talk to your father. Oh, you need to talk to him? Yeah, well, I mean, I can talk to you too if you want. What do you want to talk about? Um. I prank called you a couple weeks ago, but you didn't know it was me. Oh, you did? <laughs> Like phone number? Yeah. <laughs> well, you said um, you butt dialed me, and I made you con. I convinced you that you actually did. Oh. Well, um, I, I, I didn't. I, I haven't been thinking of you in a while, but I, I did think of you uh, during the new year, and I really. I wanted to say that I hope maybe we could be friends again. I know it got a little crazy there, but. Yeah, I think we can be. I don't see any reason why we can't be friends again. We had yeah, some good. We had so. some good shows there. I thought the dancing we and did. all that shit was fun. Like, I mean, we did. Yeah, yeah, we had some good shows. Yeah, I think we can be friends. I, I keep, I keep, I keep, I keep tabs on you. You know, you're not, you're not a nobody exactly on my Twitter feed every <laughs> once in a while. Well, you see, I'm doing pretty well. Uh, uh, I, I think. Hopefully, you see that. Uh, and yeah, so, yeah. Congrats on the weight loss. Thank you. I, I appreciate that. And the, and the mamacita here as well. Yeah, it's going pretty good, I have to say. But uh, yeah, we can be friends. Uh, but I just saw your dad, and apparently, um, this fat bitch named Carolyn Borisenko is threatening to. Well, he's saying that she, he, she's saying that your dad threatened to kill her, or something. And I hate this Old fat Carl bitch anyway. Was yeah, Carl. Carl. Big Carl. Big Carl. Big Carl. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Um. Yeah, that was the whole thing. He 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 asked her why she wants him to kill her because she said, "I think you know, Grace slurps on her daddy's dick or whatever." And he said, "Okay, well, why do you want me to kill you? Because saying stuff like that would make me want to kill you. Why do you want to do that?" And she took it as a death threat. <laughs> <laughs> you know, you know, he's very careful with his wording. Of course, he's not stupid. But she went ahead and said, "Ben Thorpe threatened to kill me," and then uh, he he tweeted after, and he said to her, he said, um, he said, Carlin, uh, what did he say? He said, "I have no interest." Of course, nobody does. Have he you seen her? Sort. Like, what the fuck? She's disgusting. Like, yeah, no, but this is so funny. So he said, so because she said, "Oh, my husband and I, we have guns." You know, she was like worried because she lives in New Hampshire, right? So like, she's only you know, she used hours. to date a pedophile from prison. Uh, anyway, I'll give you the whole story one day. But, People yeah. have been telling me that, yeah, 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 or, yeah. or so, something weird like that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But so then he goes, he goes. Carlin, I have no interest in hurting you or killing you, so please relax and tell your hubby to calm down and get back to preparing your next meal. And she reads it, she reads it out loud. She reads it out loud on stream. It doesn't, it doesn't even occur to her. And she's like, she's just, oh, she's just a lol cow. She's more of a lol cow than I realized. Dude. You know what? Well, it's good to connect with you in the, in the new year. I hope you have a good 2024. And now that we've had this conversation, I feel like we have to set up the uh, the the Ralph Grace reunion of some sort uh, here on the Kill Stream. <laughs> if you're down, if you're down. Yeah, I'm down. I'm down. I just got a lot of uh, like. Yeah, yeah, I got things right now. I, I got me. threatened by my landlord. And wait, wait, wait. Okay, now that you want to get into it, what happened? All sorts of stories. Wait, 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 wait. You broke up. Now, now that you mentioned it, what do you mean? What's happening? Are you there? Did we lose her? It's all crazy. Oh, wait, 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 wait. You cut can you out. Can you hear me? Yes, I can now. Repeat what you just said, just so we're clear. Yeah. I can hear you now. You can hear me now? Yes. Oh, I was just going to say, my my, uh, my neighbor punched my dad in the face. And the then fuck? Uh, he went and talked to our landlord about it. My landlord threatened to punch him in the face. So we're kind of in a little bit of a yeah what you'd situation. Call it, I guess a war. Yeah. 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 So, <laughs> shenanigans. It's yeah. A little, it's been a little, <laughs> little trashy little shenanigans. So we're trying to get out of it. Well, uh, you know, shit happens. I'd be the last one to say anything about that. But, uh, but yeah, I'll, I'll get in contact with you. Also, tell your father we want to talk to him about Big Carl uh, if he's free. Absolutely, and then, I and will. Then, yeah, tell him. And Absolutely. then also, I'll get back with you soon. We'll set up some type of reunion. I think we need another dance off. But uh, anyway, <laughs> take care, Grace.
Have a good one, Ethan. Hope you're doing okay. I hope you are too. Bye-bye. Bye. That wholesome. Wow. I'll be damned. Okay. Now, so that's Graystorff's background on what happened here. I thought she might answer. Ben technically is like, he's, he's not the slickest. I was like, well, I see her on Telegram. I'm just going to call her. That was nice. Was that wholesome? Was that nice? I was. I was trying to be, too. Oh, uh, there's no reason to hold old grudges. Like, when you can put them to the side, it's better to put them to the side. Also, I think the audience would like to see another Grace Thorpe versus Ethan Rock here on the kill stream. And we definitely didn't have any grudges to the level. I don't know. We both talked a lot of shit, whatever. Um, and, you know, I kind of said the standard thing about her and her dad and whatever. She, I don't even think she cares about that. So, <laughs> so uh, I genuinely do wish her well in the new in the new year, and uh, we'll see if we can get Ben on relationships and dating, but also host debates to Ethan Ralph's kill stream, which I'm pretty sure you'll be familiar with, is perhaps the most legendary blood sports platform in the history of the internet. True. Ethan and Alex right. have ample experience as moderators and have no personal allegiance to me. My proposal would be a one hour free form debate with the topic framed by you. And if you would like more structure, such as opening and closing statements, et cetera, blah, 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 no quoting studies, preparation necessary, I would bet my bottom dollar that you will not follow through. As you know, I will utterly and ruthlessly destroy you. Surprise me, Carl. <laughs> and so because he called me Carl, instead of my proper name, which is Carlin, I honestly, that's actually the first time I've even read that because I wasn't going to waste my time on someone that was refer uh, referring to me as Carl. So that happened. No, go back, go back, go back. Don't make me find that again. Come on. Okay. So I responded, my name is Carlin. You can give it your best effort to get that right before I read the rest of this. And then Ben responded and he called me a disgusting pig and said True. he was charitable. And I that, said, well, that, that is. does that. That debate's going to be a no-go, but thanks for By letting me know. By the way, I'm hearing that uh, ben, fly, Benny. Ben's available. And then Ben responded, ha ha, called it, a loser like this knows when she, he's. <laughs> he's just owning her. Why is she reading this out? Okay. Should we talk to Ben Thorpe? I'm thinking we probably. What's the oh, okay? To a dude, and um, <laughs> and she was nice, right? But her last ex, not her husband, her last ex, it was really weird. He had 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 been married to a psychopath, had two kids, and the ex was constantly attacking them. So it's like because I explained the situation with uh, Grace's mother. And it's like, it's like exactly parallel, you know what I mean? And I, I would, I would think she'd be like, oh, that's the last thing I want to get into. Cause you got six kids as opposed to two. And you know, this is also on the internet, but she, I, I know she absolutely would love to. Cause like, I for some reason, you know how people like attract a certain thing to themselves and it's like home, even if it's unhealthy. Um, but she was, she's like the most, pick me pick me in the world she hates women uh <laughs> but a lot of times those women themselves aren't very attractive you know what i mean it's like pearly things who wants to fuck her it's like thank you very much yeah but like i'm not gonna fuck you you're a dude but she'd be interesting ben. as a person on the internet ben oh can, shit can you hear me is that Ethan? yeah that, that's ethan ralph that is ethan ralph how you doing hey buddy I was just thinking of you. I I off I offered your platform. I saw that. Even, uh, even though I I, I I didn't say it was specific with this pig, Carolyn Borshenko, to uh, to do like uh, I would have been. It would have been beyond blood sport, plasma sport. I would have fucking wrecked that pig. 
for so her. What's your, so first off, I, I was trying to get a hold of you. I, I did talk to Grace. Oh, we made up. We broke bread. We're gonna do something <laughs> in the future. We're gonna we we're just too entertaining on camera. We have to do something yeah. in the future. Uh, so I don't, we, think, I don't think you and I ever actually really had a personal beef. No, you and not me, really. not really. And you know, I, don't I, so. I just like to talk shit. That's kind of how the whole yeah. thing. No, got, I, got started I with the Grace hard. and all that. You know, not yeah. that. We won't go into the whole thing, but I, I felt like, oh, okay, you know, people want to throw a few. It was more you and her. Uh, it was more you and her. I felt like. Yeah, yeah, it was. It was. It was. And it, her, and it was silly, you know. and, and I think we can have a fun reunion show. But what's yeah, your yeah, yeah. but what's your beef with Big Carl here? Do you even know who she is? Like, yes, you're familiar. Okay. She um she she does this thing that I think is horrendous on the internet of claiming to be an expert on psychology and diagnosing everybody um which you're not supposed to do if you're actually a psychologist you know what i mean if you're actually it's against the ethics but what she does is calls everyone a narcissist who's attractive um because she's a dumpy fucking loser and like that's some low level shit and i called her out on it uh, Grace rope a doped her. I don't know if you saw the stream where she rope a doped her for like 53 minutes of Is an she? hour. No, I didn't see that. Fucking went ballistic on her, and then she went ahead and coped and coped and coped and coped and coped in response. And then I said to her, and I do think this is an interesting point. I know it. People sometimes get dicey with it, but I think a lot of these type of people say stupid shit that they shouldn't say that is intended to provoke rage. And I did tell her that it seemed to me like she was trying to taunt me to kill her. And I, I, then I very, very carefully said, like, I'm not going to do that. I'm going to waste my time doing that. But wait, wait, that is wait, what wait, it wait. seems to me like she, what she you, was you up to. You thought that she brought it to the level of vitriol that she was actually trying to get you to kill her. I think a lot of these people have a death wish. Yeah, I do. I think a lot of these envious motherfuckers. I don't think you're one of them. No. But I think a lot of people get live. to a level of envy. Like... Like, uh, you know, she's one of these people who's like immediately diagnoses Donald Trump as a narcissist. Okay. Now I get that you can see some qualities of narcissism, but generally to diagnose someone with a disease, there's got to be a, like a problem in their life. The man is a billionaire. He's got a family who loves him and he was the president of the fucking United States. Where, where's the failure? You know what I mean? And also Taylor Swift, of course, because she's pretty and successful. And I just think this thing of envy needs to be called out. A fat loser like Carolyn, it's not my fucking fault, or Carlin, whatever the hell. It's not my fucking fault that she's fat, ugly, loser with no kids. But these, these people think they can just sort of take pot shots at people while saying this guy's a dangerous motherfucker because she saw the, the video where I came out with that my fucking ghetto mama neighbor and i towered over and she's like oh he's a scary nigga we better we better clean our guns all right well then shut the fuck up about my daughter don't look maybe but if you're gonna taunt me i'm gonna soft call day. it out soft day soft day i, I only heard the soft day i want to be clear uh but go, the what? go the soft a i only heard the soft it's a yeah. it's yeah, yeah 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 well we're not we're live is why i'm saying that are you live? yeah yeah yeah, oh, yeah. You are. yeah 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 we're actually live yeah, <laughs> no, yeah, yeah. no 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 wait no i go on black people i go on black people we real black have the people. most black friends <laughs> I, I understand people. look yeah, yeah, I use the N word right to their face and know, that no, actually they got love it. they love it because i used it to no, their face no, depend, I, and YouTube and, and, doesn't care about the N word. Okay, well, think. I'm not on YouTube. Look, bro, wow. just just yeah, soft day, soft day. It's no big deal. It's no big deal. I don't really understand what the difference is. What's the well, I mean, I don't either. But I don't fucking sign the checks that gets me paid every month either. Uh, <laughs> okay. And so you know, like some of them, they're a little prickly about that sort of thing. So, uh, sure, no problem. I'm happy to. It's easy for me not to say that word. That's no problem. I don't think it is actually. I, you know, the times we've had you on the show, I think <laughs> you've said that about. <laughs> 15 it, times. it feels right, you know what I mean? Sometimes it feels right. Well, I didn't say that it didn't feel right. I'm just saying, out of the times we've had you on the show, over 50% of the times you've said that word. <laughs> yeah, stand <laughs> by it. Maybe over uh, 75. Bob, I mean, generally use that word in a song. Don't John try Lennon, use that word in a song. I'm saying okay. that word in a song. John, John It has Lennon an application. 
John. It was in the title of a song. It was. It, was. it has a certain it's meaning. It's it's a. I know. It's it. an effective. It, it can be used effectively. It can be used in a way that's stupid and repetitive and trying to act like you're all that or you're down with black folks when you're not. But I I don't know. So. And can you just apologize for using the N word on the killer? <laughs> <laughs> I didn't realize. No, I no, it's word. okay. It's okay. I, I, I jumped in. He would have done it anyway, so it doesn't really matter. But, <laughs> no, 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 uh, no, no. I'm very respectful. I, I get it. Like you're making a living. I, I don't want to. No, it's all good. It's all good. It's all good. Um, so you can't say the F A G word. I, I would say, I say that all the, time. all the time. No, I say faggot. But I don't say it on. But what I'm saying is, I don't say it. I try not to say it on. So YouTube you can say because... the N word on YouTube, but not faggot. Yeah. Is that what you're telling me? Yeah, yeah, yeah. But what about the N F combo? They don't care. The NF comment. I, I, they consider the F word, the F slur, hate speech on YouTube, so I don't say it. They don't seem to care about the N word because they <laughs> let black people say it. They have to let black people say it. And so I don't think that's what you think. They can differ. I don't think they can figure out a way. Because if you go on a PFP, how are you going to know if they're white, black, or Chinese? You know what I'm saying? So I think they let it go. Now, can gay people say the F slur amongst each other? I, I don't know. I don't go on gay YouTube. Well, I don't either because it sucks, and you know they're making you know like you can't even. Uh, I tried to watch somebody make a joke about trannies last night. Of course, it was a guy I hated, but still, it was like, man, you dance around all this shit. The guy cut his dick off. Like, I mean, I don't know what to say. Um, yeah. So, Car uh, Carlin, you think that there's a possibility that they did a little snip snip, or uh, has that always been a? Feeling? Well, from the looks of it, I mean, I think she's she's one of these. People who's in the unfortunate position now that we're in the transsexual, uh, like that that's been normalized, that like a lot of people would see her and assume that she is actually a transgender woman. But that's her fucking fault. Why make why have a haircut that makes you look like a man? You know what I mean? Why why wear a t-shirt in like a slobby, you know what I mean? Why not dress like a woman if you want to be seen as a woman? I didn't say she's a transgender woman. <laughs> No, I but can any can any red blooded man here tell me that he'd want to put his dick in that? No. Is anybody, that my fucking would anybody fault? Anybody on the Is panel that my fuck fucking her? fault? <clears throat> no, no, no. She's gross. I mean, she's not like utterly revolting, but like now, she looks like who trash. would get sexually excited by that? She's what gross. would be the minimum amount of United States petrodollars that you would take to fuck her? <laughs> Fifty thousand dollars. Yeah, I'd, I'd probably do it for fifty grand. I'd like, could I get an erection in the presence of Coraline for fifty Borisenko? grand? I mean, no, you can take a Viagra or something if you need it. Like, if it really makes you. I'll sick, just, I'll just I, I, I could hire a, I, for fifty grand. I could hire a good-looking bitch to fluff me so I could have an erection <laughs> yeah, in the well, presence of Coraline Borisenko. You can Borisenko. use part of your fifty okay. grand to prepare. <laughs> yeah, that's possible. Yeah, yeah. yeah. It's but like straight up in a show. room, if it's just her naked and my dick. And I couldn't touch myself. Could I get an erection? And I couldn't fantasize about anything else. I don't think it'd be possible. <laughs> it would be extremely difficult. Uh, <laughs> All the D in China. I'm not sure. I, it's just, but I don't understand. Here's the thing. I believe every male and female has like a gift to give. And, you know, whatever. She was in high yeah, school death. and whatever. <laughs> the stud guys didn't pay attention to her. Maybe she was in the band or whatever. But uh, like some, some, Women who are ugly, like they become the class clown or they whatever, they help out with the like they they bring yeah, the yeah. cheerleaders. They carry around shit, the heavy you know I mean? shit. Yeah, 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 yeah exactly. Yeah, but like, other fuckers to make it their life work to prove that those people are actually mentally unwell and try to destroy their lives. And I'm telling you, if somebody in high school, if 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 like a jock realizes that some fucking little troll bitch in the band is trying to fuck with him and telling lies about him he is not going to hesitate to smack that bitch down and no, wait, wait, wait. maybe he'll do it carefully but like he's gonna say like oh you fucking with my pussy you're fucking with me you know what i mean because you're ugly that, that's not gonna go well and i'm just Would warning her you choke slam her through a table <laughs> i have no no desire you don't to want to do it i'm bitch. saying would you do it if you had to do it oh when she said what she said about my daughter did i want to kill her yeah what no now wait what did she say about your daughter 
Well, you know, it's the stuff. Oh, it's the but, same. Well, yeah, yeah. Okay, okay, so, but, 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 but here's the difference. Like, and I know, like, everybody, you know, there's a certain way of like ball busting, and like, yeah, understand. You're just saying it because it's out there. But she actually had only watched these NapTown. Do you know who NapTown is? Well, I is? fuck with you guys because you fuck with me. That's that's why. Just yeah, I understand. It. It's like it, was it wasn't just like, really it was you. Just like actually, I saw you in the, the chat show. when Grace was doing that, and you're like, "What are you doing, Grace?" Um, but you know. Because we had a good collaboration going. Banter and there's yeah, shit talking, yeah, and you're yeah, known yeah, for that. It's yeah, your trademark. Yeah, yeah, okay, yeah. but she clearly said, I have no idea who these people are. But she went there when Grace called her out on her, you know, lack of ethics as a psychologist. And she has an excess yeah, of calories, that's a cheap though, shot. But a lack of ethics. You're right about that. Yeah, go ahead. Yeah, go ahead. <laughs> yeah. and, you know. She's fat. I, <laughs> yeah, but you know the thing about oh, don't talk about her being fat. She after she she had Grace on, she went and trashed fat tranny, uh, <laughs> uh, like Marxists, right? And she used the word fat and tranny and whatever, and she looked exactly like him. You know what I'm saying? Well, she's I guess right wing, but like if you got a shaved, if you're a woman and you've decided to shave. <laughs> your head up to a certain point and then have one of these yeah haircuts. yeah i'm not down with that i mean maybe theoretically you're a heterosexual but like why would you wear a dyke haircut you know what i mean like, i don't why? disagree with that at all it's totally extremely unattractive ben like what is what is this like okay you know what yeah. you might as well be a dyke it's a way of saying fuck you to it's like fuck you to sexuality men. it's it's yeah. no it's to men it's like what do you mean no man wants and women this, like and women and just right. like humanity children it's, itself. Yeah, right Right. Yeah. Yes, exactly. That's Small why I'm children, saying. Like, get away from me, woman. Do you scare me? Like, it's an insult to right. everybody, Ben. That's I, that's what I think. I, and I'm just calling it out to say, like, okay, so if you want, you know, they have this thing, some black people, they have this thing called death by cop. Yeah. Where, like, they want to use a cop because they're too much cowards just to end their own fucking life. And they want to bring a cop into it and cause his career. You know what I mean? Like, fuck with this guy's yeah, head. Yeah, because he's, he's going, white. This nigga doesn't even want to live, right? So okay, like yeah, because it's a way. The day there, by the way, but anyway, go ahead. <laughs> yeah. yeah, go ahead. Well, yeah, you could kind of make it look like you're a victim because you're such a fucking loser that you want to destroy an innocent man's life. Okay, I think that there are people who are doing this on the internet. They're trying to do death by internet, and they're trying to taunt people like me to come at them. And I'm not taking the bait, but I am going to call them out. I don't think there's anything illegal about saying it appears to me that by your behavior you are taunting me to kill you. I and saying I'm I have no desire to do that, but like I can't control what someone else might do, and I, I, you're safe with me. But like someone else, I wouldn't do this. You know what I'm saying? This is Why would, would Carolyn? Yeah. Would Carolyn Borshenko want to go to the like the state penitentiary, find out who's getting out in the next couple of weeks, and insult their daughters, their wives, their mothers, and themselves? I think she should do it, bitch. But you think you're safe on the internet? I know where she lives. I no, know wait. her full name. No, no, no. Look. But I'm not saying I'm going to do anything, but I'm saying I'm just adding it up, Ethan. You know what I'm, I'm saying? I'm saying you know, but just don't. Just keep that. No. She's a public personality. Right, right, right. Public right. personality. I know. Be taunting people Unless to kill her. Unless you live in Mexico like me. But, you know, I, yeah, you know, I... She, she's Ben's a little. Not saying he will kill her. He's just no, he no. He's just saying he could. He knows, he knows the knowledge. Yeah, and he knows, he should, look, he it, knows exactly if you how, have, which makes it an yeah. imminent threat. But anyway, but if, go if ahead, you are, if you're in Mexico, no, uh, let me give you an example. If you're in Mexico and you want to say, like, "Hey, I'm a guy. I'm gonna go to the head of the cartel." No, that no, I know no, is I the head of the cartel. About that. No, no, no. Shh. No, no, I'm no, just no, saying no. theoretically. No, and you start no. talking about his mama, talk. you talk about talking his wife, no. and you start talking about his daughters. Ben. You are it, it, it's hard not to see that as a suicide I don't even mission, know right? I think that's an American imperialist pig propaganda thing. I don't see No, I was saying Pablo Escobar. If you're going to go yeah. fuck with no, Pablo. No, no, no. I yeah. lived across the street from the mafia. I don't see that. Okay, in Rhode Island. I don't see that. You get so much. If I decided to make it my life's work to taunt Gringo the propaganda. mafia. What no, what would no. you do to Boroshenko if she put you in a self defense situation? Afraid of? Oh, if she took a gun? <laughs> yeah. If she put you in a self defense situation against Boroshenko, yeah. What would you do? Or whatever. Yeah. Picture the scene. You've gone to her house. And she's pulled I knock on her door and I go, "Hey, do you want to say what you said on the internet to my face?" Which I'm perfectly within my rights to do. And she pulls out a gun and points it at me. What would I yeah, do? Yeah. I would say, go ahead and shoot, bitch.
But if she flinched for a minute, I'd take the gun and I'd <laughs> probably kill her with it. Yeah. Uh, only I don't in know. a self-defense situation, only, though. Only in a self-defense situation. Yeah. The cop told me when Jacinda punched me, I had every right to fucking hammer her back. No, and the wait, beauty no, of it wait, was, I never been hold punched on. before. Wait, wait. So I talked to your daughter for like, I don't know, three or four minutes before this. Very wholesome conversation. Hopefully we can have a fun reunion. Um, all yeah, that yeah, shit's yeah. old. You know, I was going through a lot of shit, too, and looking for ways to... No, no. no, no you no, know, no, no, no not that I wasn't provoked. I won't go into the whole thing. But regardless, uh, I thought it was wholesome. It was Water a nice, it was, it was a nice call. Yeah, that's kind of how I see it. But she mentioned we both, that, both sides got some good content right, out of it. Yeah, I, yeah, I agree, I agree. And that's all that matters. But, but I was told that you were punched in the face by your neighbor yeah okay first time i've ever been punched in the face okay but, no, wait, see, wait, wait, don't stop. Is... wait 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 hold on i'm not done with the lead just yet so what is the backstory behind you being punched in the face by your neighbor not the oh first time you don't know punched. this no yeah i i i i i had come back from it was a, it was a really wait, long wait, story wait, i went on this date that, with this yeah. Ben, start off with your relationship with this lady. Well, no, you wait. were kind of friends with her. You set up her YouTube account. Yeah, no, my no, neighbor, no, she's wait, wait. Did ghetto, you fuck or not? Did mama. You, wait, wait. Did you fuck or not? Oh, she's another one. Like, no, just yes I, or I no, Ben. Did you, did, you, did you fuck? No, she's a ghetto mom. Okay, all right. She talks well, about her I mean, hysterectomy what? all the time. Okay, uh, wouldn't let her suck your dick? That doesn't mean anything. Like, I mean, I'm just saying, like, uh, I've seen some situation she's it's, if it's, if it's she, a no to me, she's unattractive okay well what's i got to do with her sucking your dick though like that's what i'm saying like uh anyway i'm, I'm just trying to I clarify standards okay well you know to put do it i think she's attracted to me as long yeah. as she's a female and she's you know not carolyn borsenko uh you know there's a lower standard she's i would say a little bit higher fuck. and if we're in a committed relationship those standards don't apply anyway i want to be clear since i am now but uh <laughs> oh, are you but, yeah, actually, yes. Uh, I, I know there was some controversy over the, over New Year's. Yeah, you saw my uh, Killstream Senorita. I don't know. I, I, I only saw... You, you got these haters who were saying, like, you hire your girlfriend or something like they that. They did I, say I that. Know. But yeah. she's not... No, she's not hired. Uh, she was here in Merida for about two weeks, and we went to Bacalar and Tulum. Uh, and I'm going to go to Great. Mexico City in a couple weeks. So Mexico is pretty cheap to travel around, so... See now, no, see now. Here's my thing. You were Why right, by the way, Ben. Care? By the way, Ben, you were right. Uh, and I can't talk about anybody else specifically. I want to be clear because I'm legally uh, bound that I have to be very clear about things that I say. Uh, but Ben told me months ago. Now he was trying to sell me on his daughter for content or whatever. But he said, <laughs> um, you know, you, Pippen, you feel bad now. You feel bad now. But just around the corner, you never know what's coming. Uh, don't don't be down on the dump, don't don't be down on the dumps. Don't be so hard on yourself. Uh, good things are gonna mm. come. And he actually told me that on air, and I'm not kidding. Uh, and he was right. So I'll give you credit. No, oh, I'm glad to hear it. See, now what I don't understand is, Ethan, is why wouldn't all of the people who watch you go, hey man, congratulations? Well, most what, do. What is their fucking well, see, problem? See, that's the thing, Ben. Most do, but like, there's also a hate audience. You got a hate audience, right? Mine's bigger because I've been around yeah. for longer. But like, you have people. Yeah. You know, I tweet out something, and they're like, "Oh, what? Are, this is why I deserve this and that, and this and that." So it's a little bit different. But like, people do the people fuck with you guys, right? Um, yeah. And and you know, I lost a hundred pounds. I understand you ball see, busting, but like, well, yeah. But I mean, I lost a yeah. hundred pounds. You're, you can see it on my. Yeah. You can see it on I me. I did see it. Uh, and you know, I. In a nice relationship, things are going well. Of course, there's still some controversies and all that. That's what happens yeah. when you uh, procreate. Uh, but but there, uh, there's something wrong with people who actually wish that, ill what you on did. Other yeah, people. yeah, 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 yeah. I agree with that. You yeah. know what I mean? Yeah, I agree. Plus, it's unless, like, unless well, there's cause for it, good unless there's cause for it. Well, if you're doing yeah. good things, you're doing. You good lost things. weight. Yeah, and they're mad. They're mad that you lost weight. You've got a nice girlfriend. Whatever. They're mad about that, right? They, they have to find some way to undermine. Like, I think that sucks. I think people who do that, one thing, ball busting, right? But sure, sure. Another, yeah, like, yeah, if they genuinely, it. like, this is what their, like, raison d'etre in life is, like, they should kill themselves, in my opinion. Find something positive. I mean, I agree. And if there's stuff there to laugh about, there really hasn't been. I mean, what, a laugh about me having an extremely hot girlfriend here in mexico yeah. uh or going all over the country and, and doing nice things and it's just yeah it's I like unmasculine in my opinion i'm no fan of joe biden but i think these people just go on and on and on i mean the guy's old he's got a mental you know whatever like 
okay, like cut the guy some slack. You know what I mean? Like he's a human being. <laughs> he is old. Should he be I mean, president? What, what he Should he no, be president? No, but do I wish that he trips and dies and his you know well, brains no. like smashed all over the fucking no. Now, have some decency. So, how did you decency. get punched in the face by your neighbor? Also, is that what are those chocolate covered almonds? What are you eating there? Trail mix. Okay, even better. I'm homeless. Are you really? I'm in a hotel. Yeah. I'm Nigga, homeless. why aren't you in Mexico? Imagine if you and Grace came down to Mexico with the Senorita. You know, that's funny. Do you know just, how much fucking money we'd make? I just got a passport application at the post office. Dude, my uh, new passport's yesterday. coming in the mail. They tried to stop it, haters. But, yeah. Uh, the the nice thing, the thing about being homeless is like the world is your home. I, I, I still have my old I mean? one, but they put two holes through the old one so they know it's not good. Uh, but the new um, one's on the way. Um, so yeah, you know, but, I've been trying to like I've been trying to tell you guys. I got a clean team. record. No, I don't have to stay in this. No, nah, dude, it doesn't even matter if you have a clean record. You just go through Mexico. I mean, unless you're a drug trafficker oh, or a terrorist, oh. you don't have to have a clean record. Yeah, it doesn't matter. Oh, okay. So, Why are you homeless? Ben, why are you homeless? Well, why are you homeless, Ben? Because my fucking landlord threatened tell, me tell violently. Him, tell Ethan the whole story about about yeah, the yeah, punch and the landlord. It, it's a great. And story. then how you're coming to Mexico? Because I I got a flight. We can book it live on air. I'd love to get. It's about to snow up here. It's gonna be. Big <laughs> Don't be there, then, motherfucker. Behind. I live in the tropics. Like what the fuck? Come down here. Yeah. Yeah, I can get to the south in a day. But uh, I gotta figure out things with Grace. Oh, she's been she's God. been a psycho. My Bull God, fucking ben, psycho. come on, man. Oh, I agree. Well, you tied to your daughter. Oh, she can come too. I I got a girlfriend. I'm not even trying to hit on her. I'm just saying, just come by yourself. Okay. Yeah, maybe I should because I've been trying to say like we're a team. You know what I mean? And we're effective in some ways as a team because I can help her out and she can get me in places where they don't want, no one would normally talk to me. Hold me but, the other back. Ben. But but uh yeah, just come to Mexico, man. It's like keeps playing the baby. We can know? still boom her in via uh satellite here and have her on some of the shows. And no, imagine dude, ben, car ben, own. She can drive down. Ben, you would love Mexico. You wouldn't even believe how much you would love Mexico. Like uh, yeah. See my mustache? Yeah, yeah. Well, yeah. They start yeah. when I used to live in a Spanish neighborhood. They used to start talking to me in Spanish because they, they people they don't say, understand. F A F A. Uh, yeah, L F A. <laughs> El Jefe, yeah. El Blanco, uh, El Gringo, uh, a little more popular uh, in certain areas of the world. Um, okay. Plus, I'm six eight. I'll be like two feet higher than everybody yeah, yeah, in the whole country. Yeah, yeah. Most Mexicans are not that tall. Uh, now, yeah. how'd you get punched in the face? <laughs> so I, I had this back and forth with this ghetto neighbor. You know, she cranks up the music. Uh, you know, I tell her turn it down. Then I crank up it. Whatever, right? But it, it's like she's got daddy issues. She told me she was molested by her dad. I don't fucking know, but like they all were. Who cares? They say right, that. right, right, right. <laughs> she, he forced me to suck his dick. Whatever. Okay. Whatever. <laughs> sure, you enjoyed it. Now, because someone gave you some attention, obviously no one otherwise would have. Because you're a fucking ugly pig. Now. So we go back and forth, but I, I, we actually went on this huge road trip the last time shit blew up, just to give her some space, calm fucking down. We came back. We didn't even go back into the apartment that's next to hers because I was like, I don't even want to deal with it. We went in the in the apartment underneath, like the it's like a garage, and and there's what, there's beds, there's Murphy beds down there. So we're like, I don't even want to deal with it. I'll give her this space. She comes knocking. I had, I think, COVID. At the same time, I uh, I was like drugged sort of by this date I had in Boston. I was totally out of it. I was trying to give Grace some space. I finally came back and I was like, I need, I, I'm going to die. I need to like rest. You need to take care of me and watch that I don't, you know, go on, go out. So she comes knocking on the door out nice. of nowhere, 10 o'clock no, at the night. Ghetto, no, man. the neighbor. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And she starts screaming that we're stealing her Wi Fi, which. I had no idea what she was talking about. Maybe she saw something where, like, you know how, like, uh, sometimes the your your computer will automatically try to connect with the networks. I don't know what her fucking password is. Anything. She starts screaming. Starts by screaming. Starts by threatening her. And this is a woman whose entire family has like been to jail vi for violent crimes. So I came out and I said, "Oh, whoa, 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 step back." I gave her a little bit of a nudge, and I was like, "Okay, <laughs> so we can you talk, did." Wait, like, wait, 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 wait. You did nudge. I gave her a nudge. Okay. I, I, all right. No, when okay. she came forward, okay. I said, like, no, 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 no. And it's all on tape. That's perfectly legal to do. You don't have to. Well, it's not no, like not really. I mean, wait. 
A nudge? What kind of nudge? Like how? Just a little love tap. I just sat there. You, you see me? I'm a big guy. You I was, it, was a, it was a narrow between alley between you two. Personal space. I'm saying. Did yeah, you I'm push? just saying. If you want to talk? Did you stay push? over there. Did you push or did you just do this? Hey. Uh, like, you like push. A, okay, so you push. No, I'm saying like a security guard. Would say I don't like, want to sound like Nick Ricada, but you you count. Okay, anyway, go ahead. Anyway, I don't fucking care. They want to throw me in jail for that. That's fine. But. <laughs> she was creating a public disturbance outside at 10 o'clock at night. I couldn't get a word in edgewise as to like, it made no sense. Why? Uh, here's the thing. If you're a neighbor, you had a question about Wi-Fi, wouldn't you just text them? Wouldn't you just say like, hey, uh, I'm confused. Can you help me out? You wouldn't come over to them, bang on their door, start screaming at them and threatening them, would you? No, I don't think so. So I told her to calm, I told her to calm down, right? Eventually I said, call the police because... Like, you're now committing crimes, threatening, um, and you're not Come stopping. On. You're creating a public disturbance. So, police are on their way. She said something. I did use the N word with her. I think I said like "nigga, please" or something like that. Then uh, she she hauled off and punched me, which barely because she's so much shorter than me. It barely, yeah, whatever. I, I didn't the N word. I didn't. I didn't. I didn't. Put, I didn't hit her back or anything. Cops came. I told them the story. And um, no, she, she never apologized, never calmed down. She was still threatening Grace. Um, then I went to the landlord the next day and said, no, this has been happening repeatedly. I rent two places from the guy. Um, I've made him aware that she's acting completely crazy. It's not a livable situation. He jumps out of his truck and threatens to attack me violently says i'm gonna punch you in the face for disagreeing with him that he was doing a great job as a landlord so now i'm homeless well mexico well hundred there are day visas. you don't even i'm a resident a temporal for three years oh. uh, and then i can be a citizen all that stuff but you can come and live for six months for the low ben i'm not kidding no, six months it. 180 days I got a beautiful RV. And you can leave anytime um, you want. If you don't like 180 days, you can leave sooner, right? RV, dude. Right. Dude, I want to do an RV do trip through Mexico. Did you know, yeah. like, we need to revive the RV trip through Mexico. Yeah, I love it. Man, I love it. I don't think it's a big shit. deal you're to drive an shit. RV. No, you're just talking shit. Are you really down? No, so, so, so the, well, the problem I had with the RV is it hadn't been run for a while. I bought it for no, the No, we'll family. get Starlink. No, look, we'll get Starlink for the RV. So we'll have oh, a yeah, perfect connection. Oh, yeah, because Mexico might be tricky. Yeah, 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 because yeah. some of the connection is good in some places and bad in others, so it'll cut out. We'll get Starlink for the RV. Well, this guy, Darius. Um, yeah, he's a loser. Darius, the guy yeah, he's a loser. Of, he yeah. has one of those backpacks, though. You know those backpacks that, like, Yeah, yeah, up streamer everything? bags. Yeah, yeah, he's a fag. And he's trying to get rid of it, so we might be able to pull it off him because that – Does he need can't crack really, like, money? Okay, how much does he need? Look, now look, we need Starlink, Ben, because if we have Starlink, we'll, we'll strap yeah. that onto the top of the RV and we'll have satellite. But then you're stuck to the RV. You can't do, you can't do IRL though, as easy, right? Well, we'll carry the summits around. Um, you think so? I know you got to like I'll look into it. I'll, I'll look into it. I'll, I'll look into it. I'll look into it. If it's doable though. Down yeah, it's do definitely the RV, Because me, you, Grace, and I can book about, I don't know, five to 10 other motherfuckers that would be legendary. Uh, as part we of had a, RV. we we Dude. did we did an RV stream over no. the course of like no, no, eighteen man. days, and the no, RV no, was man. in shitty condition. It needed right, and but it got it got great reception. It got great reaction. Naptown, you know Naptown, the editor yeah, yeah. guy. Yeah, yeah. He did a whole series on it. I love that guy. He said he said he I like him too. The, but but ours would he be. Said we were, first off, with me involved, I don't want to brag, but I've never been involved in one of these things, <coughs> and it would be you know. All time. It's a great RV. It seats yeah, yeah. ten people. Easy. It's got a you know fridge, bathroom. Now my all girlfriend that shit. will not go Let's on the see. RV, so um, <coughs> she doesn't want to do that. She wouldn't, drop, she wouldn't even drop. She wouldn't even ride in it. Yeah, I, I might have you drop me off to her at the end or something like that. Um, but these but, are like these are like it's basically like a limousine. It's like top of the line like party bus. You know what I mean? Yeah, yeah. Well, couches. I mean, yeah, seat belts, yeah. all that shit. Yeah, she, yeah, it's not that. I, I just don't know that she wants to be that focal point of the content. Um, oh, you mean on streaming? Why not? Uh, why not let her be the cam camera person though? 
She has done a little bit of that. I don't know. We'll see. It's not out of the question, but I, I don't think you're that serious. Here's, here's a super chat. Hold on. Wait, wait, wait. Let's party with some fines senoritas and let's freaking party is Cabo San Lucas. Grace needs tomorrow. Cabo San Lucas? I know what that is. Okay, so this says, let me reload it here because uh, it was in the Spanish accent. Uh, drive the RV I'd love to down. go to Mexico. Drive the RV down, Mexico, Ben. Let's party with some senoritas. And let's freaking party in Cabo San Lucas. Grace needs more of the world to help humble herself. Dude, does she even have a passport? She doesn't, by the way. I know that. I, I, I don't even well, We just got the paperwork yesterday. I don't think it's that hard, is it? Did you both? No, it's not. Did you both fall? It's sitting in the RV. It's sitting in the RV. No, wait. Did did you mail it out or did you not mail it out? If you didn't send it out. No, it's just sitting there. I'm just saying, I I just, we were in the post office. I was like, let's get some applications for passports. Okay, well, you know, I'm in Mexico Mexico. and my passport still had some time on it and I still got it renewed and they're going to mail it to me. I got a passport card too. So when I cross the border, land border, I only have to show the card. Um, but yeah, I have a new passport coming. So, uh, yeah, I, I think we should do this, Ben. That's cool. I love it. I only have one physical. I've been sick, but I have, I have this thing called a giant lipoma. It's like this lump on my back and, uh, it's really causing me a lot of like back problems, but I heard there's somebody who does that online, like called pimple popper or does a TV show. I'd yeah. love for them to cut it out. You know what I mean? But it, it really, it really, like, so I'm trying to get a surgeon up here. But, well, fuck it. You know what I mean? I'll survive. It's has just, been, it's just, somebody said, has Ben seen my girlfriend? I don't know that he has, actually. I uh, saw a picture of you with a lovely young lady around New Year's Eve. Was that yeah, the yeah, one? Yeah, and yeah, then yeah, people were saying, one. oh, that's not. Yeah, that was the one. I love it. I got, I got bitches on Tinder. Sometimes they're fake. Um, uh, but I, almost I really think you know what's funny is people. I already mentioned this, but I did meet her on Tinder. Um, yeah, and I thought wrong. it was, I thought it was worthless actually. Uh, but it's not, it was pretty cool. So I'm thinking, I used to, I, I, in I've America, been, it is I worthless, got, but yeah, what, uh, but the younger Sometimes. ones are still in America, they're better than the older ones. Anyone near my yeah, age the younger is a ones psycho, are always, they're always better, yeah, yeah. At least they could. I would think that a nineteen-year-old girl. At least you could have a good time with her. You know what I mean? Well, She'll be fun and like laugh. And she's twenty-three. She's, yeah. she's a little bit older, you know. Um, twenty-three is a pretty good age. She's a little on the old side. <laughs> <laughs> she's I got a nineteen-year-old I'm working on today. You motherfucker! Of course you are. Why not? <laughs> well, I, that's what I say. But um, all right. Well, because because you know why? Why not? You know why? Because the fat losers like Harold and Barshenko are going to be angry. A Fuck them. $1 on Fuck them. Ben needs to go to Mexico ASAP. Ben needs to go to Mexico ASAP. Not my problem, ASAP. Carolyn, that you're a pig. Content. Medical tourism. Why, dude, you really need to come to Mexico, dude. Like, I'm not even kidding. Uh, hey, thanks. That's, I mean, it's the first I've heard of it, right? It's not like you've been bugging me to come to Mexico and I've been like, no. No, that's true. I love right. it. No, I mean, and you can bring, I, I've you been can bring to her a bitch along down or in not. Dallas. If she's too scared to come along, and I'm not trying to throw shade her way, but if she thinks that's too crazy, that's fine. We could do it. Dude, I know Mexico no, well. I, I can go all across this country now. I'm a resident of fun. Mexico. I'm, I'm not here on a visa, Ben. I'm a resident of Mexico. No, okay. So like, yeah, I love. I, it sounds like a great idea. I need a place. I, I it'd be nice to have a friend. You know what I mean? Because like everybody is like an enemy, or I can't trust them, or whatever. It'd be nice to just have a place you can go where you could be like, all right, I, I basically trust this person. I, I don't have to like feel like, oh my god, they're gonna turn on me or whatever. You know what I mean? Just like guys, it's probably a lot easier. I've been looking for a woman to try to be like a friend, but like they're they're all fucking crazy. You think they're your friend, and then you you end up like you know what I mean? They're liars. I'm trying to wrestle wrestle a pair of glasses from this bitch. I left glasses at her place. She's considering whether she's going to return them to me. What the fuck? <laughs> she won't. <laughs> um, now, um, so what's going on with the ghetto neighbor? Is is there any resolution on the table or? Uh. I actually think that the landlord, by doing that, put himself in a situation where, like the hotel room I'm staying at, he's going to have to pay for that, right? I mean, he's not living up to his side of what Elise is involved. So we got a lawyer working on it, and um, yeah, we'll see how it goes. But there's well, no I reason to stay here tomorrow, and I'll meet you there. There's there's no. 
Well, I see. I don't have a passport yet. <laughs> oh yeah, that's right. <laughs> Fuck. God damn it. Okay, you can't. I was I was trying to get down to Dallas because there's this gorgeous woman who apparently is a porn star. I don't know who was wanting to meet up with me, but I, I, I it, it's too weird. You know what I mean? Like she seems fake, maybe. So, but I was happy to go down there. I was ready to get in the RV and drive down there, or fly down there, or whatever. But I can't cross the border. I think until right, no, you, you can't, can't. Just have a U.S. No, driver's you license. Can't. No, you can't. So uh, there is a. You place, want to meet me up in uh, If you want to meet me up in Texas, I could do that. Tomorrow. I don't want to come to the United States. Um, but wait, oh, you can come to Dallas. I could get in the RV like tonight. I could be. I think it's a. T it would be a two day trip down to Texas. Or obviously, I could catch a flight, but I'd rather have the RV than I can, you know, if it doesn't work out with this woman. I don't want to stay in some woman's house. I don't know, you know. Yeah. It's not she's all into it. She, she's all, she's, it's weird thing, you think, because of what my, my, like, my, like, sort of aura online, because she's really into incest. <laughs> I guess. You know what I mean? And it's like, I'm not, like, she's like, I suck my brother's dicks. And I was oh. like, okay. <laughs> All right, that's cool. You know, like it could be fun. In other words, like, but it's a little weird because I'm not really into that. I'm like, it doesn't, you know, what, what I mean? About... It doesn't sound quite healthy. But like, no, sure, it's not if you healthy. want me to be daddy. <laughs> but I'm saying, if someone's been like, sort of like, what about uh, Houston? Sensually molested. They're what probably about an Houston? interesting person. Sexually. What about Houston? Uh, yeah. I mean, like, literally, I could get the RV. Fuck. I don't have any. I whatever. I can pick up clothes on the way down there. Uh, it's just filling up with diesel. See, the thing I is, got... they have my passport, so I can't. Learn... <laughs> the thing is, I can't. Oh, you can send you me can't... the new one till they send me the new one. <laughs> Why don't uh, I so... sit on the U.S. side of the border? <laughs> yeah, yeah, you can yeah. you'll be across the river, <laughs> and we'll talk shit at each other. Across I just the thought river about that because I can't. Because <laughs> yeah, I I need the new one, so it has the two. Like what, what is it like two weeks to get the passport yeah process? yeah it shouldn't be that long but i just not thought about it i can't cross the border either listen so. listen listen keep an eye I'll, I'll put it on twitter i'll do a stream filling out my passport application not not obviously giving out what do you details, mean i thought I'll... you had it filled out no i have the <laughs> application in the He's rv the sitting right there god damn that's <laughs> nothing what do you mean okay go ahead well i'm just saying i mean you, it's, I didn't, it's, you didn't invite yeah, me into mexico until a half hour ago and you were like what, what the fuck, man? You How should already you have a Mexico? passport. Yeah. You're 45 years old. What I the don't fuck, know. dude? Like, what the fuck? I, talk, I haven't Actually, been to the doctor. I talked to my that. doctor. You don't have a passport? What the fuck's your problem? I haven't been to the doctor since 2018 because oh, I was give like. give me that shit. Is... You sound like Boogie 2988. What do you mean? There's no excuse for you not to have a passport. You're Catholic. You should have been There's to no the There's no reason Vatican. for me to have a to, passport. You should have been to Rome. You should have been to yeah. all these places. Why the fuck don't you have well, a passport? Well, Ethan. Well, Ethan, you know, shit happens. I've been you know to all those mean. places. Why haven't you? Exactly. Let's let's remedy that. I want to do okay. that. That's why let's I've got do it. application. Okay. I'm, just saying. I'm just saying. I'm a citizen of the world. I am literally, although not no. like uh, certain citizens of the world, cosmopolitan elites. But um, are you a citizen of Mexico? Uh, no, resident a temporal. Uh, although some, oh, okay. someday I will be. Yeah, uh, I can become a citizen of Norway because my mother was born there, and that's a pretty good gig because it's like the richest country in the world. But because I'm a direct descendant, you know what I mean? Yeah, you told me that once. Shamu's in the I'm chat. Not, what's your deal? Shamu's in the chat. What's your deal with him? <laughs> uh, I told him today that you should stop lying about me or face possible legal ramifications. <laughs> That's what I tell him all the time. He told, told me, "Hey, man, get me a list together and I'll look at it." And I told him, "Shut the fuck up, nigga." You said Wait, he had a then, list then of things. That's what you said. He said he had a list of all these things he wanted to change. I said, all right, make a list out or whatever. I mean, he had this I mean it's up to you. You're the one who did the damage. You're the one who owes me an apology. What the fuck is it? How is it my no, job to list, correct you? Make Meet me in the middle. No, make a list no, with bullet points no. of all the shit that you have issue with. Suck my dick. <laughs> Kill yourself, man. So how I can think Shamu respects me. On the same side. Can we get onto the same... Uh some type of agreement here or Shamu? yeah well i mean he's already done what he did the interesting thing doing? about him well he 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 colored my in my daughter's entire career uh, by making it 
trying to make it look like I was a sexual predator as much as possible, including lying, but also editing in a way, which I don't mind to make it look like that. On the other hand, like I played him and a lot of people thought he was working for me because it did give me massive traction. It gave both of us massive traction. So even though he's a fucking cock sucking faggot ass, oh, I wasn't supposed to say that. Uh, it helped me, you know what I mean? Like Judas helped Jesus to get crucified. It doesn't mean he's not going to hell, but, <laughs> they... you know. Okay. All he should do is apologize, and I would forgive him. Shamu, will nah. you apologize to Ben Thorpe right now? No, 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 fuck you, ben. no, no, no. <laughs> Publicly <laughs> apologize for the things that he said that were inaccurate. I never told him. Did I ever tell you to edit differently? I only said about one edit that I had a problem, and that's where Grace said you should suck your dad's dick, and then she qualified it, and you didn't put the qualifier in. That's the only no, edit wait. that I think was unfair. What was the qualifier, to be fair? She said something like, whatever whatever you take that to mean. Okay, she wasn't saying it literally. <laughs> but I agree, daughters should suck their dad's dicks in that sense of supporting them. Right? You, you mean in, in, in that... Um... Yeah, uh, no, I can't agree to that, but I understand what you're saying. There, there's a there, there's um, a there, there's a way in which suck a dick means something like support you mean someone, to support. Right? Yeah, yeah, there. Yeah, yes, yes, yes. Well, in that saying. sense, yeah, yeah. yeah. Daughters oh, should suck their dad's dick. Sons yeah. should suck their dad's dicks. We yeah. should all suck the pope's dick. I mean, it gets a little crazy sometimes, but it's a colloquial phrase. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm not big on dick sucking, but um, but I know what you mean as a as a term of. Uh, turn a phrase. Uh, yeah, there. Like yeah, when yeah. I tell when I tell Shamu to suck my dick, I don't mean I that literally because he probably queer. fucking would because he's such a fucking <laughs> pussy. No, you say that shit because you're gay. Go yourself, Ben. Watch this guy's edit of me dancing and tell me he's not homosexually obsessed with me. He is. It's obvious. <laughs> Every fucking well, okay. Let I me make. ask him, Shamu. He's are like, you homosexually? Ruling. Wait, wait, wait. Let me ask him. Are you homosexually obsessed with Ben Thorpe? No, I think the dances are funny because <laughs> you get a <laughs> word or whatever, it. and you make him dance or whatever, like a fucking monkey. <laughs> but the, but you slowed it down, like you you gloried, you changed the coloration of every motion I have ever made. It's like it seems a little gay, dude. Well, you sexualize everything, Ben. That's your problem. Dude, me watching a guy dance to me is not sexual. You just you you're sexualize the one that's it. Doing it. What are you talking you about? You are a faggot. No, it's funny when you dance like a monkey because you're spurging out or whatever. But you're the one that adds a sexual thing to it. No, it's you, nigga. What? Okay, whatever. I could go to a Chippendale dancer thing. I could watch Magic Mike. It's not sexual for me. And you're I don't the sit there and go. And, and if I was to sit there and go, uh, what's that guy's name? The big Chanum Tatings. You sexualized the day, so I had to jerk off. That would mean I am gay, dude. I don't care. If 20 fucking guys were dancing naked in front of me, it doesn't bother me. It's right? I'm not gay. Yeah. You would go, oh no, I'm sexualized. And you'd be really aroused, and you'd have a real tough time with it. That's because you're gay. You get it now? No, you talk about faggot shit all the time. That's what you do every fucking time, because you're a faggot. Well, How many videos have I made of you dancing? I don't dance. Have, uh, How I don't many dance videos like have I made of any man dancing? I don't dance like a monkey. You should try and cheer Shamu up a bit and do a little dance for him again. Show us the lump. <laughs> Take your shirt off. Yeah, let's see the lump. You want to know how you want to know how ungay I am? Show Ralph right, the lump. I know this sounds gay, but I have this gay dude that I wanted me to urinate on him, and that I that I, I I sent a video to once, and he's he was super nice, and he's like, you're Tony straight, Star, I get bro. it. Uh, he came back to me around Christmas. He's like, can I get another dick pic? I'm, I know you're not gay, but like I just want to. China doesn't have. I was China. like, look, dude. I'm not gay, but like I've got this bitch. I'm lining up Ashley in Dallas, and I said like, if things get going with her, I'll save you a pic and send it to you. It didn't happen, but see, that's how ungay I am. Tell, tell him that I can send a bag, a dick pic. 
Joe Shabatoni. Yeah, when I was like 10 years old, there was a boy that I went to sleep over his house who told, told me to get naked, made out with me. I did not reciprocate because he was saying this is what older people do and we should practice. Then I got molested, somewhat molested by his older sister who was fucking hot and like 16. What'd she and, do? Well, she kind of chased me around, pinched my dick and like, you know, she was, <laughs> I loved it. I wasn't even, I didn't even, I didn't, I didn't even hit puberty at the time. But I was, was like, was I still to this day, remember, she was did fucking you hot. Did you come or was she just like torturing you? Can you come when you don't even have like, when you haven't hit puberty? Well, not, well, how old were you when you first came? Uh, I, I don't know. 25. It was, it was late. 13, 14. Oh, like no. That. Way before when that. Was, how old were you when you fucked the swimming pool? I don't remember. I'd say about 11 ben. or 12. Ben, how old were you when you fucked the swimming no, pool? I had puberty late. I had puberty late. When I made love to the swimming pool exhaust thing, I was like, <laughs> I was in college. I tried to do a hands-free, Ethan. You ever tried to do that? A hands-free? Uh, on which yeah, you have a contraption? Pool, Ralph? You, you mean a... where I the, the myself jet is coming the heat, out in a the heat jet, yeah, yeah. yeah, I know. I don't, I don't know I why. Positioned I positioned myself. Yeah. I tried to do a hands-free. <laughs> then I felt terrible nah, afterwards. But, yeah. I have no you get idea that egg you kind mean. Of, nah, you yeah, get that kind nah, of like nah, egg nah. white kind of shit, and you're like, oh, nah. the pool guy's going to find that tomorrow. No. Nah, I heard about that sort of thing. Everybody um, tried shit. Who hasn't tried fucking a vacuum cleaner? It's dicey, though. Don't. I know. I've if never you, tried that. No. That, if you stop done. the no. flow completely, you can, you, you know what I mean? You can get in a lot of trouble. I've never tried oh, that. Um, well, I'll be honest. I tried sucking my own dick. You know, that kind of stuff. You're bored. You're, you know, 15 years old, whatever. <laughs> you ate your own cum, too. You just, no, wait. Yeah. Hold on. I a beautiful mulatto <laughs> bitch who snowballed me into my mouth. Wait, That's wait, not wait, exact. Wait. I, so she sucked your cum out of your dick and spit it into your mouth is what you're saying. Yeah. yeah. And then she went to make out with me and then snowballed it. And I was like, what the fuck? But I guess she was like, well, I mean, it's in retrospect, I, I see where she's coming from. But at the time I was like, That's ben, did gross. You, did you tell Ralph about how you humped your father in bed? Uh, did I tell Ralph about that? No. Oh. Would you like to hear about that? I was in my I mean, dad's bed. A little, I was a little bit too old to be in my dad's bed. And, I, you know, somehow in, in the midst of sleep, I think I grinded up against him or whatever. And the next time I went to visit him, because he was divorced, <coughs> he put me. He was very nice about it. Didn't talk about it. The next day, like, put, put me in a, on a separate bed. It was kind of his fault because I was too old to be, like, you know what I mean? Uh, he was but, too damn sexy. It was his fault. Well, I, I mean, I, I just, I think that boys at a certain point are, I don't know. You don't put two brothers in the same bed together generally when they're like 15 years old or a brother and sister. You can, but it's kind of stupid. But well, I've slept I, in the I same, I've slept in the know. same bed as my daughter many times. There's another fucking scandal these faggots will tell you about. Because I'm in a hotel room right now, and if I needed her to spend the night, you can't get. It's very hard to get two. Where's she at? She's saying she got her own apartment. She's so, going. She, she, she still goes back. Her. Yeah, go ahead. She, well, we have two apartments, so we had the ability to split up. But um, now you're she's, together. She, I, she's trying to get her car because I I want that RV. She's been using the RV when she has her own fucking car, so it's like, you know. I didn't realize I was homeless until I'm like, actually, you know what? It's better that I'm homeless. So you're staying with her, bill. I guess, is what I'm asking. She's been kind of staying at the apartment. Okay. Then, like, I've been really sick. So when I'm really sick, she's been um, staying with me. But I, I love the idea, Ethan. I'm going to find out how long. I, th I, I think a passport, because it's, it's the like U.S. Four government, to six it's going to take like five fucking weeks. Yeah, right? yeah, it's, yeah. It's not going to be like I just head to the border. It would take some time to plan anyway. Yeah, it, it would take four right. or six weeks. Yeah, for sure. Okay. All right, but I'll get I'll get on it. I'll do my part right away because there's no downside to getting a passport. I'm sure no, it's you like should, 50 You should bucks. have one anyway. Well, it's like 150, yeah. unfortunately. But, uh, but well, yeah, it, it's not bad. You should have one anyway just in case you need it. It's a hassle. I got a couple things to fix in the RV, but I could do that in Texas. But you, you're saying you can't even... 
You can't. I mean, even, no, I'm not saying that over. at all. No, I can hop over. I'm not forbidden from hopping over. I just don't have any inclination to hop over right now. Okay. That's what I'm saying. Um, okay. So, no, I can come over. <laughs> where, we are you near in, if, where are you near? You're, near, you're, you're not near Peninsula. California. No. Oh, I'm you're near the, California. No, no. I'm in the Yucatan Peninsula. I'm closer to, to New Orleans and Florida and Texas. Oh, that's on that side. Okay, I'm sorry. Yeah, so I could uh, potentially hop over into Texas, but um, would you yeah, want to yeah. do Mardi Gras? Mardi Gras? Yeah, New, Orleans. New Orleans. It's super cheap for me to fly New Orleans because that's like the shortest flight from Meredith. That to could New be Orleans. fun. Oh, that's not too far away. And yeah, then, actually, and then, probably by that time, probably by that time, I would have a passport, right? Yeah, but I mean, it's like mid. I would have to come over there for Mardi Gras, and then we could RV back. That would that would be crazy, actually. All right, yeah. You know what? Okay, I'll look into that. Well, and I'll let's check out. Let's uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. I'll check out Mardi Gras weekend. I'll see what the flights are looking like. Uh, but yeah, I appreciate uh, you coming by to talk. I, 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 yeah. I think I, I, I sent some feelers your way. I wasn't sure. You know what I mean? Like I understand shit should happen. What do you say busy, about this busy. big fat bitch before you go? Why? Do, I would love it for you to say she committed to debate me. Then she re I said, yeah, bitch, you're not going to show up. She said, I absolutely am going to show up. And then she doesn't show up. So I say, look, you've got a big platform, right? I don't know how much her people and your people have in common, but like, what are you doing on the internet if you don't want to succeed? Everybody wins when there's an interesting debate. We've hyped it up and you're pretty neutral. I don't, I don't think you would be no, of course not. Biased to my side, even if you like I me would, personally, like I don't like her do at all. Neutral. By the way, but I would not be biased against her. No. No. So if you can make the case, look at the tweets that I put. Maybe inject yourself and go, Car Carlin. If you want to, you if know, we offer, offer her, her and I like promise some you, type of be... cake or fried food. <laughs> do you think that that <laughs> might tip her over the edge? <laughs> <laughs> Uh, but in all seriousness, no, I take being a moderator seriously. I, w I would not. No, I don't. Uh, yeah, yeah. yeah. I wouldn't say It'd be that. fun. I mean, it's a little bit of a weird debate, but maybe we could clean it because her thing was like, I'm going to debate Ben Thorpe on whether Ben Thorpe is a narcissist. It's not really, it doesn't even really have any intellectual content to it. But if maybe we change it to like, I, I think that, uh, psycho babble, like di psychological diagnoses are used way too casually on the internet. Uh, and they end up being basically an ad hominem, you know, like an insult. Uh, that might be something that would have some intellectual heft to it. And she could take all her fucking... She has a PhD in psychology. She should be able to wreck me, right? So like it'd be good, though. I'd bring fire. I mean, I would wreck her. I'm telling you, I would destroy that bitch. I would take every fat cell... Take it all out. And yeah. smear it personally into oblivion. But... Mardi Gras also, is like a whole also, week. By the way, I'm looking at Mardi Gras. It's like a whole week. Okay, I'll show you. Yeah, so the, the official day, Fat Tuesday, is the big day. What day should I get in? I've never done a Mardi Gras. No, I haven't either. Um, you'd have to it's get great in. great for at least IRL because all the bitches are holding up their shirts. Oh, yeah, and, yeah, yeah, you know, yeah, you'd yeah, have to be careful. Yeah. But like, We'll go robot streamer so we can get the, the TTS that way. Yeah. Um, okay. Can you imagine how many bitches would. See, the great thing about an RV, I'll tell you. You can't smoke anywhere anymore. Maybe, maybe in New Orleans it's different, but in, a lot of in you Vegas can't smoke you anymore. can. But that's about it. Yeah. Okay, but so you, if you've got an RV outside of a bar, people will love to come into your RV because you can smoke. You see, what I'm saying, and, and be comfortable, and they got music and whatever, and do other shit too. I know you got to be careful about it, but like, it's kind of like a, it's kind of like a built-in, like secondary lab. now we need to you do it I mean? all on robot streamer just full uncensored like mardi gras if we do it that's how we should do it i think i don't what's know that, we'll what's that what's that what's uh, that is that a platform yeah it's a platform and 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 they're just you know as long as you're not breaking the law uh they're all good with it robo so. streamer rope a robot streamer uh, but, but that's just yeah, cause a lot of young maybe people. we have one feed on rumble and maybe we have one feed on robot streamer i don't know we'll see uh, but, and we can get Naptown to edit and put it on YouTube. Yeah, yeah. So it's just like the highlights, you know? If you're down, we'll see. I don't know. Don't just talk all this talk. That's we'll college, see. bitches. I love college. I, I, that's, that's my age. I like them too. You know? I'm with and they don't mind now. streaming. They don't mind streaming. You know, like they're used to it. They're used to they're, they're They've had their pop, cherries popped for the most part. You know what I mean? No, wait a minute. I won't get into that. Because they're on Instagram and all that stuff. Like they get it, you know? And they don't Some fucking care if they're kids. 
They don't care if they flash their tits at New Orleans. It's good advertising, right? It's all about it's good a pair advertising. Of tits, you know, what's where the can they deal? find you, Ben? Ah, it's January six. Also, say something about J six, man. What the fuck? Is that what today is? Yeah, Insurrection Day. <laughs> we'll say something. Destiny, Destiny wanted to debate whether Donald Trump tried to overthrow the U.S. government. Hey, what a ridiculous point. Uh, yeah, Ben Thorpe, a.k.a. Abel. My daughter is Grace Thorpe, a.k.a. Joan. On Where's YouTube. Grace? You know what? We'll save her. We're going to have her on a special reunion show. Oh. We're already talking about editing a, a little introduction package of our best and worst moments. Uh, I like the idea of me going down there first and her determining whether she's going to be a fucking baby for the rest of her life. Well, no, but look, her ass we'll still a do a show with happen. her. Well, look, we'll still do yeah. a show with her, but yeah, we'll still do a regular kill stream with her. But I think she, who the fuck? I think she should go down to Mexico, but it's up to her. Um, and I got a girlfriend now, so herself. I'm not trying to She can handle her. herself. Yeah, yeah, no, you never did. I never she did. She was hitting thing. on you, honestly. And it, was all, it was all a bit. You know what? If anything, I won't even get into it. I, I didn't save everything, but if anything, there was a person being hit on. Yeah, but. Anyway, <laughs> true. Um, it was a bit, I, but she I was, was definitely flattered, doing even it. though she hits on everybody. But uh, shout yeah. out to you, Ben. Shout out to Grace. I hope you guys have a thanks, buddy. Here. All right, peace out. Thanks. Later, care. guys. Peace you all uh, for hosting me here in, in this Discord. Thanks for coming by. Yep, for sure. Hi, Ralph. Bye -bye. Even Ralph, that's fantastic. You never know what's no. going to happen on the kill stream. Thank you for watching this clip. This is the CAC of Remember to like and subscribe.